Hey everyone, how's it going? For those of you who have been wondering how I've been able to type my altitude and heading in the chat so quickly, well, this is how. Because of Cover Me by Julia Six. Now, before I say anything else, I'd just like to make a small disclaimer that I am not responsible for anything that might happen to your account or your computer or your neighbor next door. <laughs> You're responsible for your own actions by downloading this program if you choose to do so. I personally have had no problems with it and I don't think I'll ever have an issue with the program, whether it be a virus or Gaijin disliking the use of the program. Um, from what I've seen, there have been two Gaijin administrators that have actually approved use of this. However, I just want to say again that I'm not responsible for anything that happens if you use this program. Okay? Alright, with that out of the way, basically, all you have to do with this program is just download it, extract the files, and run them whenever you play War Thunder. It's really simple. You can only download it from the subreddit post on the War Thunder subreddit at the moment because you're not allowed to actually link to programs on the forums from what I've seen because of the potential of viruses. And I'll be putting an annotation or two on the screen for the link to the forum post as well as the subreddit post and the links, of course, will also be in the description, as per usual. Now, to download the program, look for the most recent version. It should be at the top. For me, it's 1.041. Click Download. It'll take you to a Mediafire link. Download again. And I save it to the desktop, because that's just easiest for me. Now, once you've done that and it's all downloaded, you'll go to wherever you saved it. For me, like I said, it's on the desktop. And you'll right click and extract here. Or extract to cover me, or extract wherever you want to extract it to. <laughs> you do what's best for you. And then from there, if you want to use the program, all you have to do is either double click to run the coverme.exe from the folder or you can send it to the desktop I'm, I'm sure you know how to do all this but you know <laughs> I figure I'll just be thorough and explain it and that's all the program is just that little box um, essentially how it works from my understanding of it is that it pulls the speed or not speed sorry altitude and heading from the War Thunder browser map. Now if you're unfamiliar with that, uh, you can actually open up a map in your browser of choice from War Thunder. Uh, I think you can still get to it through the game options, um, but if not, I'll see if I can remember what it is and I'll, I'll post that in the description as well how to do it but basically it pulls um, the altitude and heading from there because the browser map gives you all sorts of detailed information about your aircraft like speed horsepower uh, manifold pressure altitude I think I already said that <laughs> as well as your location on the map this basically just posts the altitude and heading in the chat if you do hit the command fast enough. Also you can change some some settings in the settings file if you need to do so. I've kept mine default but if you have low FPS for instance you can change some settings there to make the program work better and so on and so forth. But let's, uh, let's go in game and give a quick example of how this works. And now, through the power of editing, we're in War Thunder. Alright, so, to activate it, you can just hit 
T or two. Of course, you actually have to do it a bit faster, so let's try that again. There we go. Anyways, guys, that's it for me today. So I hope you found the video helpful. Maybe I'll catch you next time. And until then, happy hunting.